Welcome to November College Football on a gorgeous evening from Iowa, where Iowa State has won a school record nine straight home games versus Big 12 foes, a streak that began two years ago against Texas as the Longhorns, ranked as high as 15 this year, return to town, truly desperate to escape, this time with a win. Xavier Hutchinson. That's as good as it gets. Pick up a 24. Clearing out the safeties with a vertical route. See the edge pressure. Nice job keeping his eyes up. Right here, making a play on the perimeter. And go get it. Third and goal from the four. Worthy. Trying to find the edge. Worthy tips on to the pylon. He is in for the Longhorn touchdown. Now they finally put the ball in the hands of one of their elite playmakers, the true freshman Xavier Worthy. This guy can roll from Fresno, California. That goes down as a touchdown pass for Hudson Card to Xavier Worthy, and that feels like a 95-yard strike right there of Hutchinson. Veteran move. Put you out to Hall. Breeze Hall. First down run and more. Foot race is on. He cuts the cross. Brees Hall angling to the pylon. And he is in for the Cyclone score. 47 yards for the All-American, Brees Hall. And he extends his all-time Big 12 record, his 21st game with a rushing touchdown. Texas hurt by this option last week against Baylor. Iowa State went to school on it. They got Brees in space. Nice job right here design-wise. Get your guy the ball in space. Brees says, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'll cut this back. Yep, you too. And Blackjack, 21 straight. That worked. Oh, gosh. They want to do. Hutchinson lets it fly. Tariq Milton is posted in. His first catch is for six. See Hutchinson in motion, extremely deep. Watch how deep he is. That ensures the backward pass. Now that safety that's been so disciplined all night long, playing deep to the short. Says, I'm going to go in. Oh, shoot. Over the top, Tariq Milton. House call, good protection up front. Oh, man, if he would have missed this one, I can't, I can't <laughs> even tell you what the receiving, receiver meeting would have been like on Monday. Well, you know, on Monday, Milton's going to walk into the quarterback room, right? <laughs> exactly. Let me, let me give you a few pointers, Brock. Texas is now wearing number 94. First and goal from the two. Cody directing Hall. They give to 28. He's got his second touchdown tonight. And Iowa State starting to run away with this thing. Jack Trice, Jared Russ, 43, the fullback, checks back in. He said, hey, the ball's inside the three. Let me lead Brees to the promise. And watch him on the back block, 43, going to lay the wood. Brees with a great cut. Goes a long way there initially, untouched. They might want to put that in the playbook. All now over 100 yards, two touchdown runs. Last two drives for the Cyclones have started at the Longhorns, 49. Iowa State has most certainly capitalized. He can't believe a disappointing loss. His defense did not show up in Morgantown last week. They gave up 38 points, the most they've given up in a couple of years. They come out tonight on their home turf, and they make a statement. Boy, they do they ever. Seven points. That's it for Texas. And under 200 total yards of offense. Yeah, he challenged his defense. John Haythock defensive coordinator challenged them as well. They played the lights out tonight. And they will finish just over 200 yards of total offense as Texas loses its fourth in a row for the first time since 2010. Meanwhile, Iowa State, good things happen in the names once again. A streak that started with Texas and it continues with Texas. Their 10th win at Jack Trump.
Tri Stadium in a row against a Big 12 opponent. And boy, did they ever win the second half.